My name is Renzi Ruiz. I was born in the Philippines, in Manila, but uh, my parents came out here when I was seven, so uh, pretty much this is all I know, LA. I call my blog Street Zen because I feel like I found enlightenment in just walking around the streets and observing people. I was looking for something creative to do and a lot of people were saying, hey, you know, you, you take some pretty good pictures, the way you compose them is really nice. So that made me think about what that was and why that was. So I started learning about cameras. I was also looking at different genres of photography and one article came up about street photography and it literally took two things that I already enjoyed, exploring and taking pictures. I was like, okay, uh, that's something that I can, I can do. I can just walk around my neighborhood and take pictures of things and it gave me a different perspective of how to do that. Once I found Roy DeCarava's work, Ray K. Metzger's work, those photos that they took really spoke to me. And I said, okay, that's the route I wanted to take. There was a mood, a feeling to them that, that I, I don't know, I just felt it. I've lived in LA pretty much all my life, and I really didn't know downtown as well as maybe I should. So I started walking around and really getting to know the different areas of downtown, starting with the Jewelry District, of course, and then uh, checking out Chinatown, Little Tokyo, Fashion District, Financial District. I mean, there's all these little areas that have different characters to them. I just walk around to observe, to observe the light, so I gotta stop right here. Or walk by right there. Cause the sun, it was like right here. And then it's already moved like that much. Uh, finding areas where I can get a good composition. I like overall what's going on in this, in this area as far as um, a backdrop, as far as the lighting goes. Along the way you're gonna meet people and just be compelled to connect with them and, and take their picture. You see how the, the light's hitting you, this shaft of light? How do you get the background to be dark like that? Well, that's because it is dark, and you're really well lit. Nice meeting you. I'll What's your name? I'll touch Tanya. Tanya, okay, I'll look up for you. That's exactly the kind of light that I, like, makes my day. Walking around helped me to gain a different perspective on life and it allowed me to, to become more at peace with like what's going on with everything and my state of mind and my spiritual emotional state started to change. There is a walking meditation. When you walk and you breathe in and you breathe out slowly, you just go into this zone where everything feels right, everything's working, you're coming up with all these ideas because you're just in that bubble, you're in that zone. And that whole act of breathing, setting my mind in a specific way, really facilitated and helped everything moving forward from that point on.